My oldest brother, Felix, was a brilliant student, brilliant student and a brilliant athlete. And he went to, uh, Schiller, uh, to the Schiller Real Gymnasium, which was one of the best high schools in, uh, in Stettin. And uh, even though uh, all the Jew Jewish students were asked to leave, the principal didn't want him to leave. First of all, he didn't look Jewish, and second of all, he was a great asset, both athletically and scholastically, to the school. So he told my mother, don't worry about it, L leave him be, because he's of great uh, benefit to us. Under the Nazis, that period became a period of Rassenkunde, where they were taught racism, the racism of the Nazi ideology. And uh, dif the teachers who were teaching it were not on the staff. They were, they were Nazi functionaries who used to come and uh, teach in the morning this course in racism. It was based on, the, on, all, on that whole bizarre notion that you can tell a race by the nose and by the this and by the that and, and that uh, racial character, Jews are a race and all that sort of thing. Well, in order to demonstrate uh, what he was talking about, the teacher used to pick uh, on a student to illustrate what is the Aryan face, what is the Aryan head, what is, and so on and so forth. Try to make it very scientific. Well, one day he picked on Felix. And Felix was a blonde, very handsome boy, well developed, and he gets up in front of the class and he tells him to take off his shirt and he turns his profile and he says, now you see a pure Aryan head and now you see pure blue Aryan eyes and even the eyebrows and he goes on and on and on. And he says, you see the, the chest development in the shoulder bones. This is Aryan, <laughs> typical Aryan. Okay, this class is still not roaring with laughter, but then he tells him to take off his pants and he wants to go on. Now the class is, you know, roaring with laughter, but they are not saying anything. He is insulted. He thinks that this is refle a reflection on his teaching technique. And he runs out of the class, and he puts the class on report with the principal that they have no respect for the, for the, uh, for the Nazi uh, ideology and that they are hooligans and oh, all kinds of things. Uh, <clears throat> the background of this is that there were young boys, for example, who resisted go belonging to the Hitler Jugend. Well, that was very punishable. That was very punishable. And he thought that he had come across a group of these kids who didn't want to be... Uh, regimented under the uh, Nazi rules. So uh, the principal, what he said to him, I of course don't know, but he did call my mother in and he says, I'm in a terrible quandary because uh, this guy, if the kids tell him why they were laughing, I am, I'm out of a job. Not only out of a job, it might even be worse. So you have to take your son out now.